Hey, what's up guys? It's Matty S, the Call of Duty Magician, and this is the David Blaine Snap Change Tutorial. Let me do it for you really quickly. It's something that David Blaine has made very famous, and I think you guys are going to like it a lot. So let me show you the, the performance first, and then I'll go over how to do it. And as always, if you guys want to see more magic trick tutorials like these, be sure to drop a like on the video. And let me know if these tricks work out for you, really. I do hope that you're actually able to take these tricks and show them to your friends, because magic's a lot of fun to show to people. So... Um, that's about it guys, let's get into the performance and then I'll go over the tutorial. So this is the performance for the David Blaine snap change and let's get into it. It's pretty easy to do and I think you guys are going to like it. So remember a card, don't remember this card that's a little too obvious. I'll, I'll go through the cards real quick. Ready? Did you get one? No, that was a bit too fast. Alright, let's go again. How about this time? You got one? Good. Alright, this was not your card, was it? Good. Ready? Check this out. Did we get it? We did. The Queen of Hearts. Pretty cool, right? So this is a really easy tutorial. All you have to do is um, you force them to pick a certain card. You force them to see a card. You ruffle through the cards. You say, oh, that was too quick. We'll be a little slower. And to get them to see the final card, all you do is you hold the final card back a little bit with your index finger. And when you're spreading through the cards like this, with your, you hold your middle finger on the cards, and your index finger holds the final card. So once you let go with your, your middle finger, I leave my index finger there, and I hold the last card just a little bit longer, so like this. Slightly longer. And you see the Queen of Hearts sticks in your mind. So if you went through it real fast, you'd get the Queen of Hearts again. So it's really, really easy to do. Um, all you do, like as I said before, is you separate the back card up a little bit just like that with your index finger so your index finger holds onto the back card and the rest of the deck is held with your middle finger and your ring finger so you spread through those cards and you hold the last card a second longer and that's basically it so that's how you force them to pick the queen of hearts now what you're going to do is you're going to take two cards you're going to hold it as one and to do the snap change part to do this part that was a bad angle but um i did it right the first time in order to do this part what you do is you're going to hold the two cards together as one and you're going to say you know was this your card or this wasn't your card um, and you're going to hold it in the bottom the bottom corner where the numbers are and what you're going to do essentially is you're going to pull the back one you, you'll, pull, you'll pull the front uh, what am i saying you'll pull the front one back and you'll let this one go forward and as you push it forward use your index finger to support it just like that so one more time you hold it the bottom left hand corner where the numbers are and you pull back with with uh, your middle finger you pull back you push forward with your thumb and then you use your index finger to straighten it out and to let the the front card clear into the back so one more time I'll show you that from the back all you're doing let me get it oh there we go is you're pushing the back one forward with your thumb you're pulling the front one back just like that real close up right now let me show you hold them together one goes forward one goes back and it clears just like that so this is something you'll have to practice in front of the mirror to get it good eventually you can kind of go like that and it turns out pretty well um, and then when you have the deck as well once you do it you can ditch it right onto the deck like that so like you'll notice once you do the snap change, it lands right on the deck, essentially, and you can you can show their card openly and freely. So, that's the Magic Trick tutorial, guys. Drop a like if you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if you have any questions in the comment section down below. That's the David Blaine Magic Trick Snap Change tutorial. And uh, that's about it, guys. Once again, my name is Matty S, the Call of Duty Magician, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.